as a business person, like, don't you want to know what your competition is, first of all, right? How do you know that, you know, what you're saying no to, at least know what you're saying no to, and then say no. It's okay to say no. Because I'd been in the business, when I saw the, the model and the platform, I said, I told Steve, I was like, this is a way that we can help agents um, get off that hamster wheel all the time. Like we, you know, it's almost like a moral obligation at this point for me to let people, you know, see the EXP platform, you know, whether they decide to do anything or not, it's okay. Like, you know, it doesn't matter to me, but I feel like this obligation, because like you said, life happens. We've all dealt with life, you know, in different ways that come unexpectedly and knowing the blessing that it has been for us, um, you know, again, he and I talked about it a lot. I mean, we were going through a really stressful situation and thankfully he's doing well, but I mean, how, how many times have we heard and have we even all experienced in our own life, like how stressful it is when finances are a problem, right? Mm -hmm. You know, when you don't have enough money at the end of the month, like that's stressful. And mm -hmm. so we talked so many times about how grateful we were that we didn't have that stress on our back along with the health stress that we were dealing with, you know? Right. So right. it really, for me, has, has um, that even fueled my fire more? Like Kathy, like, you know, you you've got to let people know there's better ways and yeah it's just, yeah exactly well and you know a couple of minutes ago i got all fired up and passionate about it, but that's where i'm at with it i just i want to scream from the rooftops like just look at this like just come look yeah because you don't know what you don't know that's you know right. like you need to at least see it for yourself and evaluate it for yourself and yeah you know put your numbers that you did last year into this model and what does that look like how much more money would you have made if you'd have been here because that's paid multiple true. ways yeah yeah exactly. totally i mean everybody and so anyway yeah i'm passionate about sharing it because i know what it can do i used to dread january mm -hmm. you mentioned that like oh like, yeah yeah we just did 180 deals my team and i we, we got you know i've got awards up here on my shelf that i won yeah. but why is it you know keller williams because we were the top this and that and whatever and all this stuff but where am i at january 1st right back at zero back at zero yeah oh, i hated it yeah <laughs> so, yeah I, mean, I got burned out on it. i just i loved it but i get the same time i got i was like oh my gosh like this is making me crazy yeah and so i saw this four years ago I had no intention of making a move yeah sean called me up hey would you take a look at this i know sean sure i'll take a look i'm not moving i told him i'm like you know if you're trying to sell me on another company like been there done We're that happy. yeah Totally. I'm at a hundred percent company. I've been here for seven years. I don't mm -hmm. need all the bells and whistles going on. Yeah. All the companies. Like I just, I don't need it. Yeah. You know, I got my yeah. team and we're doing great. And then I looked at this and a week later I made a move because it just, it made too much sense. I'm like, yeah. you know, whatever. And so I'll call agents and you oh, no, not, no, not interested. Nope. I'll never look. I'll never look. I'm like, you're like, what's wrong with you? <laughs> like yeah. I just want to reach through the computer, the phone and just like, look, you know, snap out of it. <laughs> it's crazy too, to me, you know, going back, you know, I'm all, I just, I, I'm all about business, you know, I mean, just all about business. And I mean, it blows my mind. Like, yeah, it just blows my mind. I'm like, how do you know what you're even saying no to? As a business person, like, don't you want to know what your competition is, first of all, right? How do you know that, you know, what you're saying no to? At least know what you're saying no to and then say no. It's okay to say no. But from a business perspective, I, don't, I never understand why people are not even open-minded because, like, again, from business, it, that makes no sense. You know, if we're not growing and expanding and open to ideas and business, you know, again, it things may not be for you in any component of the business, but at least know what you're saying no to. Right, right. It doesn't hurt to look. That's right. Mm -hmm. It's free to look, you know, and again, right. I never, I never push this. I don't want to push this on anybody. Like, Me just either. look at it. If it intrigues you, we'll, we'll dive in deeper. If that's it right. intrigues you, we'll stay in touch on it. Three years that's from right. now, whatever, life happens to you. and. Now you want to know more and that's fine. Like it's just, I'm not here to push anybody. Mm -mm. That's but, right. But just look, mm -hmm. you know, and then you evaluate it for yourself and you know what? It might not be for you. It's, I don't think it's going to be for everybody. No, of course not. But mm -hmm. man, I just, I don't know. It's, it got me. See, when you say that, Jeff, I'm like, no, it's for everybody. No, I, 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 I deep down, I think that. I believe that. I think that, but maybe they don't. But yeah, at the end of the day, like you said, we're, you know, it's just, yeah. yeah, it's just they a, have to it's make a better way. It's a better model. You're going to make more money. You're going to grow your business. 